Hi everyone, today I have a review of Grace's sightseeing outfit. It is $30 and contains one t-shirt, one skirt, and one pair of shoes. I was really excited about this outfit from the time I saw the illustration on Grace's book cover because black and white striped shirt, um, how French is that? It may be very stereotypical, but I don't know, it's also adorable. So when American Girl finally released the actual doll outfit, I was beyond excited and knew I was going to get it as soon as I could. So this is the first time I've opened this, so lucky you, you get to witness my first reaction. The first thing that you get is this gorgeous black and white striped shirt. It is three quarters sleeved and um, it of course is the Grace Thomas logo. So that you know it's officially Grace. I don't have Grace but it's like a brand name to me so. And it has um, black sequins on the bodice which is probably what I could live without. I, I wish that was just plain black because I think the sequins just make it dressier and I like casual outfits more than dressy outfits but I can I can deal with the sequins. I mean I wouldn't have gotten the outfit if I couldn't have but And there's a cute little white bow to jazz up the outfit, which I really like. And I really like that this shirt is black and white, because black and white goes with everything and looks so good on every single doll imaginable. So not only Grace, but probably every doll in your collection. Redheads, blondes, brunettes, dolls with darker skin. Um, yeah, this is going to look awesome on, on every doll. It's, um, the shirt itself is, feels like cotton and stretch cotton. And this is the back, of course it Velcros. Has a nice snag-free Velcro, Velcro. But yeah, I, I absolutely love this shirt. It's going to mix and match so well, which is very important to me when I purchase American Girl items, especially modern American Girl items, because... If I can't mix and match an outfit, I really don't want to get it. So, the next item is this white skirt. This is actually probably the most surprising thing in the collection just simply because I didn't expect it to be tulle. I guess maybe it could have been cotton. It could have been this layer itself. I didn't expect there to be two layers of tulle. But the tulle provides a, a dressier look. And um, as a friend of mine pointed out, the skirt would look really nice paired with Grace's City sweater. Especially with the coordinating um, red ribbon around the waistline. This is the back. There's some elastic in the back making this will probably be a really easy fit for a doll. But yeah, um, I really like how well it goes with the actual shirt. And it's your choice whether you want the red to show or not. I think, I don't know, I don't know how I would prefer it, but I think the skirt is awesome with the shirt itself, and the polka dots really don't stick out too much, so the stripes and polka dots aren't too clashy.
And then you also get some sandals. Which, um, these will probably have to grow on me. They are very stylish right now. So I know American Girl is all about making the tr making the trendy items. And this is definitely the trendy item. Obviously going to look better on a human with um, toes that are separate. But <laughs> this is still going to be cute. And I really like the fact that it's plain white with some silver on the bow. And it slides right on to the doll's foot with this elastic band in the back. I do actually like this outfit with boots better, but I didn't really want to pay however much money for a pair of black boots and a shrug and heart-shaped glasses. So I'm not going to worry about having boots with this outfit. <laughs> but yeah, here's the other sandal. And this is a complete ensemble. I just absolutely love it. I love the black and white and, and the tiny little touch of red. It's going to be perfect for like a dressy affair or even a casual affair. This is probably my favorite outfit in Grace's collection, even though I love most everything. So another friend bought Grace's sightseeing outfit for her 26, and when I saw that picture of 26 in this dress, I knew it was fate. I had to get this dress for, or this outfit for 26. So that's who is going to be wearing it first. And voila, isn't 26 perfect in this outfit? The shoes were harder to put on than I thought, but... They have surprised me with how cute they are. And I'm sure I will be using them in no time. I did decide to leave the dress or the shirt untucked, but I'm really not sure about that because if I can zoom up, the um, hemline is really uneven, so I might actually tuck the shirt into the skirt anyway so that the hemline doesn't show. I don't know. So if I kind of tuck it in, it might actually look better. <laughs> Whoops, let me uh, pause this video first. So what do you think? Should the shirt be tucked in or not? I do like that the red is showing. I actually think that the sightseeing outfit looks better on a doll with medium skin or darker than it does on Grace, but that's just me. Please stay tuned for more videos. I will be having more reviews coming up shortly. Thanks for watching. Bye.